Greetings and welcome back to Fisher Wealth Management's Financial Tips Series. Um, once again, I'm Rick Fisher and I'm the managing partner here at Fisher Wealth Management. Um, this week's tips on about estate planning. You know, critical to every financial plan is a great estate plan. You know, every great estate plan plans for both death and incapacity. You know, what happens to your affairs and financial interest if you die? What happens to your affairs and your financial interest if you get sick or become incapacitated. Um, according to a 2015 Rocket Lawyer Estate Planning Survey by Harris Poll, 64% of you, 64% of Americans don't even have a will. And the number one reason cited, they hadn't got around to it yet. One word of advice, get around to it. If you don't make out a will, guess what? The state you live in is gonna make one out for you and most likely you're not gonna like it. Um, and it will absolutely make the process much more difficult on your loved ones. If you have children, who's gonna take care of them? How's the money to be divided or divvied out over time? But remember, you know, you do only use a will one time. It is important, but equally as important are some other financial planning documents, like a financial power of attorney or a health care power of attorney or a living will or advanced directive. You know, these are the documents that will give other people the authority to act in your place for financial decisions or medical matters if you can't do it yourself. After you have these basic planning documents in place, pay very close attention to what I call a state organization. You know, check out how all property is titled and double check each and every beneficiary form that you have like on life insurance or retirement. Make sure that those are in keeping with your best wishes. And remember these are just the basics. You, you might also need a trust, a trust for children, a digital executor to pre-plan your funeral. So my best advice to you is that you just need a plan. You know, don't procrastinate anymore about something this important. You also deserve an advocate who's done this a time or two. So if you're not having these types of conversations with your advisor of choice, or you just want a second opinion, I welcome you to call us at Fisher Wealth Management. Because remember, you know, you're making plan for one retirement. We've made plans for thousands. So thanks again for tuning in and stay tuned for more Fisher Wealth Management's Financial Tips Series.